Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I am super excited to share this video with you because this is my three months result on the iRestore Professional. And here it is. I've got a piece of blue tape on there, which I'll explain in just a few moments. moments. But this is the device that I've been using to regrow my hair for the past 11 weeks. It's not actually three months. It's one week shy of three months. But I'm going to show you my before and after pictures in just a few minutes. And I am kind of blown away by the results. But what this device is, and this is the iRestore Professional, and this is their unit that has the absolute most LEDs. This has 280 LEDs and red lights, and red light therapy is proven to regrow hair. And I'll put a link below to Dr. Dre's video in which she bought this device herself, and she says the studies totally support that this red light therapy does regrow hair, and this personally is the device that she chose, and I can certainly see why after experiencing the results that I have in just under three months. And I'll be showing you my before and after pictures in just a few moments, but some of you asked me about my earlier experience with the laser band. And I did use the laser band about two years ago and I used that for about a year and a half and it did work. I, I will say though that between the two of them, I think this device beats it by a mile and I'll show you my results in a few minutes and I think you might agree. But in the comments section, many of you ask why I quit using that device. And first I have to say that on YouTube, my job here is in part to try a lot of products and show you the results. So I don't think that's a problem to use something for a while and then try something else. But in my case, I had a real interesting problem with that other device. And that is that I became sensitive to the red lights. And I think that's because I had three what they call BBLs, which is intense pulse light, and it uses the red light therapy on your face to bring up pigment. And what happened is that over those three or four BBLs that I had, not only did it bring pigment out of my skin and slough it off, but then it started to really bring a lot of pigment out on my forehead and I got a huge amount of pigmentation here. And for those of you who followed my channel, you know that I've recently used Obagi to help get rid of that pigment, and it's something that I fight all the time. So while red light therapy is proven to grow hair, it is generally also proven as a wonderful anti-aging device for your skin. And so really, when you use something like this, you're not only getting hair growth, but you're potentially also getting fewer wrinkles on your forehead. However, if you're me, that is not the case because I became very sensitive to red light therapy and some people are. And so basically what had happened is in using the band there, I realized that I was getting huge amounts of brown pigmentation on my forehead right up here. It was getting really, really bad. And since there was no front on that device, there was no way for me to block that red light hitting my forehead. And I actually gave that one to my son. And then when I saw the iRestore Professional, I really wanted it. And I kind of jimmy this up a little bit, and you won't have to do this. Most people do not have the problem with red lights and pigmentation that I do, but I liked it that it had this front area here, and it actually has a little guard here that's kind of designed to cushion the blow. However, I'm so weird, it made a huge mark on my forehead. So you can remove these, so I took that out. But how I use this, and I do use it as I direct every other day for 25 minutes, and you may think that that sounds like a long time and that it would be hard to do, but my husband and I both use it and we're finding it very easy to use because it has this little battery device with it. And actually, I believe that this is separate. You have to order this separately, but I would totally recommend this to you because if you don't have the battery, you have to sit down by a plug-in source and sit here for 25 minutes, read a book, watch TV, something like that. But I really like this battery pack because you charge it and it stays charged for a long time. And then basically you turn it on, and I turn it on the 25 minutes there, and you hit start, and I don't know if it will start. It probably won't have the red lights except if I have it on my head. So you probably won't see the red lights there, and I don't want to mess up my hair. But basically you start this, and then you clip it to your belt, and you become totally portable with it. And sometimes I use this in the morning when I'm unloading the dishwasher, doing stuff like that. But in most cases, I use it three times a week, Tuesday, Thursday, and either Saturday or Sunday, usually Saturday. I do about 30 minutes on my recumbent bike in the basement. So I just put this on while I'm doing my biking 
and within 25 minutes I have not only done aerobics for 25 minutes but I've also helped to regrow my hair and as I started to tell you when I'm using the I Restore Professional I basically put a little blue piece of tape across my forehead and then I use the front of the unit to hold it on there and then I sit there for 25 minutes and that way my hair is getting all the hair growth benefits of the I Restore Professional but my forehead is not being exposed to the red light which in my case is a problem okay let me go ahead and show you my three months results okay here is a look at the right side of my face and I did have problems I called them my televangelist temples I don't want to push my hair back because I don't want to mess it up but anyway this is a look at my right temple on August 24th there on the right side and as you can tell there's not a lot of hair up there it's starting to get really thin and then here we are just 11 weeks later about three months later and as you can see there are hundreds of little tiny hairs growing in and the temple area itself in the before picture you can kind of see through the temple I'm getting bald spots even in the temple and then in the after picture things are really filling in nicely and that was a look at the right side of my hair and now I'm going to show you the left side and it's very similar there you can see on August 24th in the before picture you can really see my scalp and my hair was just in the process of going further and further back and then in the after picture as you can see those little tiny hairs are coming in all around and they look like they're maybe an inch or an inch and a half long and that is so funny because just about a week ago I went to visit my dermatologist about my hair loss because I want to throw everything at this the I Restore Professional and anything else I can and I'll tell you some of the other things I'm doing in just a few moments but she did a good exam of my hairline I pulled my hair back and she says oh my Beth you are getting a lot of little baby hairs in here and she said they aren't broken hairs they're just little tiny baby hairs that are getting their start and I asked will they always stay baby hairs or will they get long and she said Beth they will get long they will become full size hairs over time which is very exciting so let me show you the front of my hair before and after there I am on August 24th and as you can see in the front crown of my hair you can really see quite a bit of my scalp there it's a little bit scary and then in the after picture that area is filling in some but I'm also getting those tiny little baby hairs all along the front and while they're not totally thick yet you can tell that my frontal scalp is heading in the right direction so I am super excited by those results but I do want to tell you that of course if something can happen to me it will happen and that is that how the eye restore professional works and how the laser light therapy is proven to work is that as we get older our hair growth slows down and we get more and more follicles that become in a dormant state they're not dead yet and over time they do die if they're not woken up but basically those little dormant hair follicles you know produce very little to no hair but once you use the red light therapy it's proven to stimulate those hair follicles and get them back in the active growth phase and it basically speeds up the growth phase everywhere on your head and hair has about a six to seven year growth phase where it's growing longer and longer and then it has a phase where it sheds and unfortunately right after I started using the device maybe about a month later I looked in the mirror and I said oh my gosh I am shedding so much that I've got a bald spot and let me show you what happened and as you can see by that little spot there the spot that I started out with was really getting worse in my opinion at that point and at that point I emailed my contact her name is Lauren at iRestore and I said you know I'm not sure that I want to keep using this anymore because it seems like I'm shedding more than I ever have because I've never really had a bald spot right in the middle there and she said Beth I know how disappointing that can be but it is one part of the process for some people because it depends where your hair is in the hair growth cycle because if some of those hairs were about to fall off this speeds it up and you could have some shedding initially and she said that is normal and it can happen with some people and so I really thought about whether or not I wanted to continue and I thought well I've got a month invested I might as well try a little more and so I stayed with it I think I missed one day because for one day I decided not to use it that I was scared of it and then I thought you know I don't want to go around with a bald patch there and she did say people who stop were not sure if they're able to regrow hair there so I thought oh my I better keep going and as you can see by my results now at 11 weeks everything is really growing in and I've lost that bald patch it's filled in and I'm really happy with where I am right now and for those of you who are suffering with thinning hair I didn't think I had that problem until a couple of years ago I never had great hair you know it was always kind of long blonde and thin but it wasn't horrible 
but maybe a year, year and a half ago, I'm 62 years old now, so maybe just past 60, I started noticing that I was starting to thin and my temples were going further and further back. Again, I called them my televangelist temples, but it just seemed like a funny way to describe that. But it got to the point that right before I started using the Eye Restore, my hair really was thinning and I was starting to really worry because you see a lot of older ladies, 70s, 80s, that have huge bald patches on their head and I really don't want that to happen. And after studying a lot about hair growth, which I've been in a hair growth phase, so I've been reading everything out there about this and watching lots of YouTube videos, I've realized that the minute you start to see your hair start to thin, that is the time to do it because you don't want those hairs to go dormant because once they go dormant, the hairs get smaller, they get miniaturized, and those follicles eventually stop producing hair altogether. And once those follicles die off, you can't save them. So if you're starting to experience thinning, now is the time to do something about it. And I'm really convinced that this device works. Now I will tell you that I'm also doing some other things. I am using their anti-hair loss shampoo and anti-thinning conditioner, and these have all sorts of ingredients that nourish the hair. It says for thin hair, nourishes hair to promote fuller, healthier looking hair, helps to prevent hair loss thinning due to breakage for all hair types for men and women. So I am using this. And I am also taking these vitamins, which I absolutely love. These are the I Restore 3 in 1 Hair Growth Formula Vitamins. They have biotin and saw palmetto, which is known to be a DHT blocker. And what DHT is, it's dihydrotestosterone, I think. I'm not sure I have that right. But basically, it's a male sex hormone, and we all have it. And as we go through menopause, sometimes our hormones get all out of whack, and we start getting more testosterone. And this is a DHT, or testosterone, blocker. And Saul Palmetto is proven to do this. And I thought it was interesting. In the comment section, I had one lady point out, she said, I love these because they are Saul Palmetto and have the DHT blocker. And she said she had looked all over the internet and this was the best buy she had found to get this DHT blocker vitamin. So I really like those. And here are some other vitamins that they did send to me. And thank you, Irisor, for partnering with me on this video because I am loving your products. But I didn't love this product. These are the hair growth gummies. I don't have the exact name of them. And actually, I can't say I didn't love them because the problem was that I did love them. They taste just like gummy bears. And my problem is, and for those of you who watch the channel, you know I have a little bit of an addictive issue, especially with anything sugary or that tastes like sugar, even with artificial sweeteners. And basically when I would eat two of those, which was the dose, sometimes I would eat four, sometimes I would eat five. And I thought, Beth, you're gonna poison yourself just because you cannot control yourself. They are very good, and if you can control yourself around sweets, I would recommend those highly. However, I really like this particular formula better because it has saw palmetto, which is the DHT blocker, and I really do like this, and you just take one of them per day. Transparent with you, about a month ago when I went to my dermatologist, she recommended spiralactone, which is actually a high blood pressure drug, but it has been shown to increase hair growth. And, and I did start on that because I wanna hit my hair loss with everything I can. But the unfortunate thing about spiralactone is it can take six months to a year to show any results at all and you do have to keep using it indefinitely. I'm not totally jazzed about the fact that I started that, but I do want to try everything that I can, and so that will be part of my hair growth journey as well. And I will say that if you're experiencing hair loss, it is important to do everything you can do to get those hair follicles stimulated, and one of the best things you can do is actually to go to a dermatologist. Many of them specialize in hair loss, and they can help you get down to the bottom of why you're losing hair, but most all of them agree that red light therapy is one of the best ways out there to stimulate hair growth. And I will link Dr. Dre's video below and also a wonderful video from two hair loss professionals out of Australia. And they totally swear by red light therapy and I'll link their videos below. And actually after watching several videos that they did on the benefits on red light therapy for hair growth, I had decided that even if iRestore did not send me the unit at no cost, as I hoped they would, I was going to go ahead and purchase it myself. Plus with the one year guarantee, what did I really have to lose? Well, that was a look at my first three months on the iRestore Professional hair growth journey, and I am super excited about it, and I can't wait to show you. I think I'll do a video at six months, and maybe another video at nine months or a year, certainly, because my preliminary results are better than I could have ever expected, 
And actually they say it can be three to six months before you even see the beginnings of hair growth. So I feel really good about my results so far because as you could see by those before and after pictures, it is really working and I am really growing in younger looking hair. Okay, one more thing I wanted to tell you, and that is that there is a huge Black Friday event at the iRestore website, and I'll put details of that below. They haven't given it to me yet, but I will share details with you about that and a link to the sale below the video. And another thing, if you all have tried the iRestore Professional before, I'd love to hear your comments in the comment section, or if you've tried any sorts of red light therapy devices or any other thing that you have used to help regrow your hair, I know we would all love to hear that because all of us over 50 have similar health and beauty concerns and one of them unfortunately is solving the issue of thinning hair. And if you're not a subscriber and you're interested in all things anti-aging, I hope you subscribe and or click that little bell and or share this video with a friend. Okay, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and I've been reading from these Miracles Now cards from Gabrielle Bernstein. Let's go ahead and choose a hopefully positive thought to think about for today. Here we go. I begin my day with love. I begin my day with love. Oh, friends, that is a really good one. It is basic. And it is hard to do sometimes when you wake up, sometimes you run out of bed, you get through your day, you get your to-do list going. And the last thing you're thinking about is beginning your day with love. And recently I have been beginning my day with love in part because I made myself an affirmation tape about happiness and that has a lot to do with love. But that reminds me that I also created an affirmation tape about hair growth. And I meant to mention that earlier in this video because I don't know if it works, but I think hair growth affirmations could work. Hair growth affirmations could remind your scalp that you want it to perk up and grow that hair. And so if you're interested, I'd be glad to share my hair growth affirmation video with you. Please just put a comment in the comment section below and at my next posting, I'll go ahead and post that video. But let me think about this. I begin my day with love. Oh friends, this is so necessary and so true. And unfortunately, the world just does not seem to emphasize just good old fashioned loving and caring and being kind and being considerate to others. And I really think that the remedy for that, for that lack of caring and lack of love is just to remember that it is important to place love as a high priority in your life. And when you roll out of bed in the morning, the best way to get your day started is to begin your day with love. Take care and I'll see you in my next video.